Hey, and good morning, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. I hope you guys are doing blessed and well on today. Queen, let's see what's going on with you guys. I heard the word limelight, okay? Somebody is about to be thrusted into the spotlight. It seems like they're being put on the spot. This could literally be at work. I'm seeing somebody, uh, well, I'm not going to say anything about that because it's a surprise, okay? So just understand whoever you are, if you have a birthday this week or next week or something coming up like that, just be in for a very shocking surprise. It seems like somebody is going to show up that you have not seen in a very long time. But I don't feel like you're going to be um, disappointed to see this person, whoever they are, okay? Somebody's definitely in the military. Action, Miranda. Okay, so it's uh, what I was picking up on. It's something uh, ritualistic going on. Somebody is doing some kind of ritual. I mean, we know this, right, fam, masculine? At this time, I feel just protect your energy. Just keep your energy covered and protected. That's just what I all I can tell you. It's just to stay prayed up and just stay just prayed up, bro. Because you have on the full armor. Action, the temple path, strategy, Archangel Gabriel, and there's that freaking deceit with the storm warning. I'm warning you right now, it's going to be a turbulence of negative energy, but just bypass it because trust and believe me, you know how to get out of whatever this is, okay? In the best way possible without you having to do something degrading. You don't have to stoop low to anybody's level is what I heard, journey adjacent possibilities you are heavily protected period and that's just what it is someone I, nobody can do anything about your protection like all any door that you go through wherever you step foot is protected period patience and then you have healer of the ages i heard the word conjunction congestion it's, it seems like a, a whole lot of traffic just out of nowhere but i feel like at that time god is going to speak something to you God is going to speak something to you regarding a certain situation or maybe somewhere that you are headed or something like that. I don't know. Or you could just simply get some kind of downloaded idea. I don't know what this is. Or this could even be someone calling you and you're having a long conversation with this person. Okay. Hill of the ages, the garden and the gate, man holding a heart. Yeah. Woman holding a coin, Archangel Chamuel, attachment, the indecision walking away so it's like you don't fully know whether you want to walk away or not but you will have to indeed make a decision because you don't understand it's ritualistic something is a ritual here somebody is performing rituals on you it's like they're trying to get you stuck into something that you're not in agreement to i heard your subconscious also, be careful of who you are telling your movement to. Like, don't tell nobody your moves, bro. That's, I mean, I feel like y'all already know this, but I mean, like, in an aspect of telling somebody your every move, like, what you doing step by step, don't do that at all. Like, there's no reason for anybody to know exactly what you're doing throughout your day or something. I heard the word itinerary. Somebody wants to know every move you're making, literally. There is a reason why they're doing this. Um... And like I just did a Virgo reading and I'm, I, I don't do Virgo readings very often because Virgo is like the most hated Zodiac sign. And I don't care what nobody says, period. Virgos are the most hated Zodiac sign just due to their intellect, due to their uh, grind, the, the, the fact that they're going to work for their shit. They ain't asking nobody for a fucking thing. People do not like that shit about Virgos. They fine as fuck. They good people. And that's just what I know for facts, bitch. That's just period. And I'm, I'm just I'm just really sick and tired of energy like this or like you that keeps constantly attacking people over and over again. And you have no cause for whatever this is you're doing. And that shit is not going to work. It's going to backfire on you horribly. Whatever your stupid ass is trying to do up under this moon, you're about to have some very bad luck. So whatever. Who cares? I feel people just need to stay the fuck out of the way. This is somebody who constantly is trying to be in competition. Between worlds here, I heard El Salvador. This is not fated for them to win. These people are not going to win against you. The most high God is going to make sure nobody's bringing any problems is what I'm hearing. Higher power, chaos, and conflict in the reverse. These people are very deceivious. They're deceptive as a motherfucker. Envious, jealous, spiteful. They don't have a leg up. They're not getting shit over on my dad, period. Or this is you. You're not getting shit over on my father, so just stop trying. Milk and honey. 
somebody hopes that you're just not praying one day or you're not protecting your energy one day so that they can just come in with this negative shit and cause some kind of you know a uh, bad luck or something to you they're sending people to you blah 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 we know this milk and honey are changing the wind flexible i feel like you can do whatever you want wherever you want when you want how you want that's just what i said yang in the reverse be cautious of these false ass twin flames these false ass motherfuckers trying to come into your life claiming to be your person thinker in the reverse building blocks i heard breaking bad Somebody named Bando or some shit. That shit lame as fuck. Orlando. Building blocks in the reverse. So, yeah, whatever this is, somebody is not thinking. They're not doing something properly. And that's why this is all going to fail. It already failed when they thought of this idea. This is a longtime enemy of yours. Somebody who just sits in the background. Somebody who you have not seen. Seems like in years. Like, you have not seen this person at all. But they're not happy with what they're seeing. They're observing everything you're doing. They're going in the spirit observing you. Literally. Like, they're, they're needing to know every move that you make. Like I say, every step that you make, they need to know it. So that they can try to sabotage you. It is not working. You're guided to regeneration. Anything you do is lucrative. Anything you do is lucrative, literally. What they're doing is just ludicrous. It's crazy. Somebody named Chris. Somebody is just literally crazy. Somebody is psychotic with this action that they keep taking over and over. And it's like they keep waiting constantly on moon phases. They wait on the moon. I mean, I heard Barney rumble. Barney's is significant. Barnes and Nobles is significant. Somebody is doing a lot of reading, a lot of studying. I heard Rhonda. Okay. Somebody is um somebody is doing a lot of reading. I mean a lot of reading. You're studying something. You're you're but see, I feel like whatever this is, this reading energy, it brings you peace. Or you could be reading some kind of article that's very interesting and you're going to be researching something about that. Don't know. I also feel like somebody going to find out some fucked up ass news about something on Facebook or Instagram or something. Or somebody's going to message you and tell you some fucked up shit. And you're going to be like, well, why nobody else told me? Why am I finding out this from a stranger or something like that? I don't know. Buy the book in the reverse and then clean it up. Yeah, some, something is a mess. Something is just very messy. Something is not meant to go the way that somebody wants it to go. It's not going to work in their favor because they don't have any favor. What I said, or this is you. You don't have any fucking favor. You don't even know why you're doing something. And if you did know this shit is very petty, this is jealousy, it's envy. You don't have no true reason to be attacking this person. So this is that coven of witches and warlocks that just refuse to leave y'all folks alone. I'm not making this long at all. I'm getting very impatient with this energy. This shit right here is not about nothing. I feel like just keep going, Divine Feminine Masculine. Y'all folk definitely, uh, you definitely, it's my name, Lily. You definitely need to be prayed up at all times and just simply, you know, um, handle this energy however you need to because it's like it's getting worse. It's not going to get better on these folks' end, but they cannot come in and disrupt your forward movement. So that's all I truly care about because I'm seeing now that you are going to conquer someone like you're conquering demons you're conquering your enemies whatever the case may be it seems like somebody is literally losing everything around them they're losing everything because they won't leave you the fuck alone okay and you're not with this deceptive envious energy so yeah somebody is not able to come in and trick you love begins reverse suffering in silence and harmony yeah like i feel be very cautious of these people trying to come in and act like they're your person. I'm telling you, somebody is, they're trying to do something to trick you with this moon cycle. Also, Divine Feminine Masculine, pay attention to the moon phases when hoes and niggas be reaching out to you. These people reach out to you either a few days before a new moon or a full moon or a few days after period or on the same day. These hoes and niggas think you're stupid. You are not dumb. It's like, how, how could they possibly think you're so fucking stupid? Like, are you kidding me, bro? Accelerated motion in the reverse. Like, somebody really thinks you're dumb. Memories of love in the reverse and disruption. Like, I feel they, somebody knows that there's someone completely different here for you. They're trying to get you tied up into some kind of contract with them. It's like, yeah, well, if they can believe that I'm their person, then I can trick them into actually being with me so that I can bind them some kind of way. No, you're not. You won't be binding this person to you. This person is very bored. This person has nothing to do on a daily basis. They never have shit to fucking do. So that's why they keep choosing to come and fuck with you. This person is heavily into the fucking occult. 
this person has been being threatened as well. They don't have any heart chakra energy. That's why they can't manifest shit because their heart chakra is closed. This is fake. All of this shit is fake. This is fake love, fake, fake ass love, authority, foundation, and achievements. Divine feminine masculine. I was definitely about to say Virgo. So you could have Virgo heavily in your chart. I seen 10 10. You, you are the only one with authority over your life. These people are very dark. And it's like, it's, it's so many clues. Like, it's so it's so much here that you can just tell, like, bro, what, what do you want kind of energy? Like, what is it that you want? I'm saying the word isolation. Whoever you are, you're definitely isolated. You don't fuck with many people. I don't feel like you're just sitting around the house doing nothing or anything like that. But I feel like you're just not fucking with people. You don't just be in people's face or something like that. You're enjoying your life third eye chakra because you see the bullshit. And you would rather stay away from it or something. That's the truth of the rule. I'm trying to tell you, you, you just don't want to deal with it. And it's like somebody's trying to force you to deal with them. These people are trying to come in acting like they're so sweet, like they're so genuine and generous. No, do not fall for it. Also, be careful who you are helping as far as finances. Be careful who you are giving money to or accepting money from. Somebody is suffering in silence. It's not your destiny to suffer. Whoever you are, you've already been in your job season. We keep saying this over and over. This is a spiritual spy. This is somebody who needs to watch everything you're fucking doing. Everything. Memories of love in the reverse and then conflict and defeat. You're not really sad. Whatever this is, you're not going to be affected by it. I feel like your prosperity is just growing, growing, growing. Whoever you are, bro, you have a really, really good streak of abundance here waiting for you. It's like... um. Somebody can't believe that you're still here or they can't believe that you still are accomplishing something because they put a whole lot of work into something, but they don't have any ranking in the spiritual realm to do any of this shit. So now they're concerned about your sudden wealth. How does this person still have sudden wealth after all I did to them? Bitch, this person has sudden wealth because of what you're doing to them. What are you talking about? This person will be rewarded just simply because of the fucked up shit you keep doing. You would think that people will stop doing stupid ass shit, but they won't. They're just steadily thinking of more ways to try to bring you down and they cannot accomplish whatever this is it won't happen yeah mature man it's also a uh, older masculine here that's finding out a child is not theirs or masculine you might be finding out your daughter is pregnant or you could just have a grandbaby congratulations but i feel like somebody's always thinking about you you got you got good luck on this path that you're on whatever this is is working for you you dig a really sheer fan masculine? Like, whatever this is that you're doing, it's working for you. It's going to always work out for you. But see, these people is mad because they can't access your great fortune and they're in fucking poverty. These hoes and niggas got to go to court. I can't make this up. They're not accessing any of this sudden wealth. Whatever they thought they were going to get, they're fake as fuck. They're not getting any of this. I keep saying this over and over. But, you know, maybe they maybe they believe that with different moon phases or different kind of moons or you know how they got the names of the moons and shit. I seen 1300. Well, maybe with this new um, chocolate moon, I can, you know, man, bitch, get the fuck out of here. I can come steal some shit with this new chocolate moon. All these goddamn names of these moons and shit. These hoes and niggas be sitting back waiting and they try to do something to manifest a loss for you and they only steal for themselves. They only steal from themselves. They never get any of this shit that they're trying to take from you. I don't feel like you're slipping at all. I don't feel like you're going to get caught slipping. It's something about the Holy Spirit completely taking over the dynamic of your life, period. Because I feel like at some point you may have been blinded to something, Divine Fam, Masculine. You may have literally been blinded to something in the past, but that's not going to happen ever again. God definitely got you covered. Full coverage energy here. God has you covered completely. And there's nothing nobody's going to fucking do about it. That's just what I'm telling you. They can try all they want. They can spot all they want. They can cry all they fucking want. Who gives a fuck? They're denied. Or this is you. Yeah, four of cups reverse. You're not missing out on any opportunities, I feel. I feel like you're stronger than ever. Yeah, you're in wish fulfillment. You are satisfied. Even though you have a ten of swords here. Like I said, I don't feel like you're just sitting around dwelling on the past or dwelling on whatever, you know, somebody did to you or whatever. I don't I don't feel like you're doing that. I feel like you're simply moving on. It's a Taurus here. The Hierophant here with the Ace of Cups. Yeah, so your person could be a Taurus or you could be, or whatever the case may be. I don't know. But yeah, it's, it's something here for you that's just solely for you. You're going to get whatever it is you want. Somebody is crying real tears because they can't block you. Seven of Wands reverse to the Queen of Cups. They try to block this person, but you're moving on completely. Excuse me from whoever they said. These people really thought that they was going to get some kind of Ace of Pentacles from you. No, they're not. 1444. They're not getting shit or you're not getting nothing. 
at this point, y'all hoes and niggas been doing this shit for a very long time. You've been working on this for a very long time. You keep getting defeated. At this point, you should already have some kind of game plan to, to make something on your own and not need to use someone else for their shit or try to take from someone else. Because you have been putting in too much work and you just keep losing, failing epically. Epic fails. The devil in the reverse. This feminine or this masculine does not carry devil energy. This, this person is just not fucking going to do it. The two of cups reverse, like I feel. Hoes and niggas trying to pretend like they're your person. They're not. Three of cups reverse. This whole little group is being dismantled. Whatever this is. Somebody got on some green boots or some shit. Bitch, you look like a damn fool. Eight of wands in the reverse. This bitch is like a fucking fool. Literally. Yeah, the four of wands in the reverse. So whatever they were trying to do to come in, acting like they were your twin. This is like the twin flame card. The four of cups. I mean, the four of uh, wands, but that's in the reverse. I'm telling you, this is not your person. This this person is not your person. Like, they, they trying to act like they on the same thing as you or some shit, and they're just not. 1555, queen of wands. Everything over here is in the fucking reverse for this person. Y'all don't match at all. It's a techie-ass motherfucker right here. Y'all folks do not match whatsoever. Like, literally. Somebody named Brandon or Brennan. Brendalyn or some shit. Brendalyn, I don't know. Jacob. Tony. Child, this person right here is a fucking loser. What's this Queen of Wands, right? <laughs> These readers, bro. These readers is just like, bitch, you're not winning anything. Just stop it. Just fucking stop, man. Just stop. You're taking yourself through so much stress. Oh, I have to win. I have to win. You're not going to, though. The five of wands is for you, bitch. You're not. You're getting caught. You're under judgment for all of this sneaky shit you're doing under this moon cycle. God. I'm telling y'all, folks, these people are just losing. This is just losing all around the fucking board, bro. Losers. That's the ace of soul fucking true, bro. Just losing, man. Losing. And they can't walk away because they got something to prove. It doesn't matter. You're the winner. Look at the page of swords. They're stalking everything you're doing. Somebody is still trying to gather some kind of information that they just don't have access to. How is it? How is it? We did so much. We did so much. Yeah, you didn't do enough. You didn't do a fucking enough. You can't take this person out. That's what I'm saying. You won't ever do enough to take this person out. They have a jackpot while you're sitting back watching it, bitch. We know. That's not going to go like that. What else is here? This person is moving in silence. I heard dumbbell. This person love working out too. I mean, that's a good thing, right? Working out. I mean, why don't you work out a way to mind your business, though, bitch? Work out a way to do that. Bad nose, bad panties. Straight up. What's the tea on this energy? I'm sick of this person. And it's all because of ego, jealousy, competition and shit. Somebody is going bankrupt. They're going completely broke because of this. And they can't look you up any longer. I mean, but I keep telling people that they're not going to win against you. So, oh, well, this is a ritual. Somebody been doing rituals and now they're haunted by these same entities. They keep trying to send to you. They, bro, this person has been doing this shit for a long ass time. These people, they've been doing this for a real long time. Somebody's having major, major setbacks. Yeah. And they be lying too. Never has the face. Made shit up. Lies. This person is a goddamn liar. They be lying to entities claiming that you did some shit. Claiming that you did something. I mean, you got to know hoes and niggas is being tricked because my father sees everything, hears everything, knows everything. Don't you think that these, whatever the fuck this low vibe and shit is that they be calling on need to get more information before they try to come and attack you? That's the stupid shit I be talking about. Cloud hungry. Same shit, different day. You would think this is a fan of yours or something. Even if you're not on social media or anything like that, they're getting their karma. They're getting bad karma. You're getting good karma. Good karma. We. Even if you're not on social media, this person's a fucking groupie. Period. You're an idol, but you are on social media, so yeah. I feel like you're also going to pick back off, pick back up where you left off 1919 with something. Yeah. This person is fighting themselves because they done caught some kind of disease or something. What the fuck does that have to do with you? I'm really trying to figure that out. How does that have any ties to you at all? Yeah, I told you they fucking fans. Somebody is truly into you and they don't know how to approach you because they they keep getting rejected. It's like somebody wants you to let your guard completely down so that they can come in and act like they're your person and you will accept some kind of offer and you're not. You're not stupid. 
you are just not going to do that at all. Yeah, they're waiting on what? To still be played the fuck out, fuck hell. They're waiting on something. This person is waiting on your, your demise. You don't have one. You're too busy fucking winning. You don't have a demise. You have nothing but wins. Whomever you are. Okay. Let's get one more card and I'm getting the fuck up out of this. This shit is old. This shit is old as fuck. What else is that? Thank you very much for the messages. This shit is old. You have defeated the devil a thousand times. And you got a group of people that are still working on some stupid shit. You gotta come in and block you. You're not going to be blocked. There's no way you can be blocked. You're already in your destiny. A lot of y'all don't realize that you're literally already in your destiny. It's like God has already handled something for you. You literally have no reason to worry about anything. And I know if I'm sick and tired of reading this shit, y'all are sick and tired of hearing it. Somebody's mama or something. I, I'm, I'm just, I'm just overall tired of this, bro. Because it's like, what is all of this for? It's spiritual warfare. You know what I'm saying, fam? That's one. But it's something, it's something very great over your life. Like you have a, a very major calling over your life, and I can understand why people don't, you know, want to see you do anything because they don't have shit to do with it. <laughs> They didn't help you do a motherfucking thing. So, of course, you know, they're going to want to block you off and shit. Let's get a money card. Of course, they're going to want to block you off. Like I felt, you're growing. It's nothing nobody can do. There's exponential growth, period. You're going to grow. You're going to excel. Working in silence. You're, it's like you're, it's something that's just simply showing for itself. And nobody can block it. Nobody can block whatever this is that you're doing. And it's because you're simply not telling them what you're doing. So that's why they go in the spirit and stalk you. You dig a real shit, fam, my son? But it doesn't matter what information they feel like they collected. They still are not connected and they still won't be doing shit. I'm going to leave it right here. Remember, God loves you and so do I.